Hello everyone, I'm going to play a little bit of Golf Clash, just kind of show you around. I know I've done this before. Uh, this is my smallest account that that I'm playing with. As you can see, I have some chess over here. You'll see to, yeah, I will, I'll touch the screen and just over by here, you'll see free offers, free. So I'm going to click on that. And what I've got is eight hours from now, I'll be able to get... I think it's 200 coins times 10 videos that you watch and they're anywhere from 10 seconds to 30 seconds and you, they give you 200 free coins and you need coins in order to upgrade your clubs to enter tournaments things like that all right so what I'm gonna do is they give you these free chests too every two three hours and so I'm clicking on them I don't know whether you can see that white dot hitting here Okay, and so those are cards. So I got five cards, and when I get a hundred cards, I'll be able to change that five to a six. So it's upgrading that club. Okay, these are season tokens that give you gifts and so on, balls, uh, tees with prizes in them, and things like that. So it's a very entertaining, fun app to play. It takes a bit of skill and patience to play it. Okay, so we're going to continue on there. So. Now, another half an hour, there'll be some more chests right up here. Okay, you'll see me tapping on that, or just below there, you'll see a white tap. Okay, so now I can tap um, this one here. It's ready to be opened. They're on little timers, and this isn't going to give me a lot. When you see three, when you see five, six, and seven, get excited because there'll be some goodies in there. But that gave me 48 coins for free. It's giving me 14 cards to go towards a dart to upgrade that from a 4 to a 5 because you'll see the 4. Okay, click again. It gives me uh, 10 tokens. When you get a silver chest, you get 10 tokens. When you get a gold chest, you'll get uh, 20 tokens. And when you get a platinum chest, you'll get 30 tokens. Okay, so now I'm going to click on this gold. Okay, and it, what it's going to give me is 4 rare cards, which are clubs that either I have or don't have chance of finding some balls and 15 random cards for all kinds of different clubs okay I'm just gonna click on there and it's gonna start the timer as you notice here I only have 158 at the very top here I'm tapping three times there's a dot that shows up 158 gems and that's kind of like money in a sense I only have 15,000 coins this is a very brand new account I'm gonna click on my self here i don't have a picture because i have not hooked this up to facebook uh to get my picture off facebook but i've earned nine thousand coins i have fifteen thousand coins so nine thousand coins that i've earned is playing the fifteen thousand coins is getting free coins opening chests and so on i played 32 games i've won 30 of them and so my at this point is 93 percent percentage rate that won't last okay because i'll be running up against people that have better clubs so okay so i'm going to go out of here for now we're going to let that run okay i'm going to go down and click on the golf bag and it shows you my golf bags i have the extra mile which is an excellent club it's a two in my other account i have a seven okay i have a viper uh, which is a fairway wood the goliath which is just a one uh, apache that's a three that's a long iron the apache the goliath let me click on that uh, okay, and that shows you I can hit 130 yards. The accuracy is very poor. It's at zero, so it's not very accurate in the wind. Uh, it has good top spin and has some decent back spin. Has some curl, and I'll show you what curl is about when I play here. Okay, so the Goliath and the Backbone are good, good clubs. Again, the Tsunami, Tsunami, sorry, hit Tour Seven at the bottom here. Okay. It hits not quite as far, but the accuracy will be nearly 100% by the time it's maxed out. When it opens, I'm not playing the tours. I'm only playing one tour one and two. And right now I've got some decent clubs that I can build up and get these up to maximum. Then I'm, what I'm experimenting with is taking and then I will play the higher tours risking more coins but I have better clubs and so I'll be able to outperform other players because my skill level will be high, my understanding will be high, and I will have the clubs to back up that, alright? So 
Here's one, for example, the castaway I'm using as my sand wedge. When you hit the sand, which I recommend you don't, at this point, I can upgrade it. Um, and I could spend 340 coins to upgrade it. That green beside the yellow shows exactly what it does. Now, it won't hit as far as the, as the castaway. It's not got any accuracy. Top spin, yes, the top spin is fine but I've got some top spin and I've got great backspin which is more valuable for when you're trying to shoot a dart at a windy target so I find that anyway has more curl the castaway and the ball guide which is important and I'm tapping down here is that this one is almost complete it only needs a bit more this one here has got no absolutely clue where the end of it is it's over here somewhere okay but okay it doesn't show you when you're playing so when we play and I'm if I get the sand I have to imagine that that is there at the end so you can over hit a shot if you're not if you're lining up the end of it you have to remember that there's still some there you can't see all right so the desert storm is not one I'm gonna even consider to upgrade it's gonna sit there and build up this uh, 101 over 4 which means I could upgrade it several times, but I am not going to spend coins on that. I'm after the Malibu. I'm after, you know, that's a great club. And I'm after eventually the Spitfire. And this is the club that I'm going to want when it opens, but it doesn't open to Tour 7 unless you get lucky in some chess. All right, so let's go play a game. And we're just going to play again. Um, these are other things that are going on but we're just going to play against somebody and i'm only going to play tour two okay i have played tour three or no i don't think i have actually i have to go back and look so this is going to match me up with someone that's fairly about the same as me this this hole is challenging because it has trees across and just a little tiny opening for the hit and you have to be aware of the wind if it's blown across you have to set okay so I'm going first I have to set the club so first thing I do is put my top spin because I know I'm gonna have to do that you see the wind over here is saying 1.9 see I'm tapping on it okay so that means I need to crowd it over here to the left and then I'm just gonna take and just add a little bit of and I'm gonna try and hit a perfect shot which I did. Okay, so now if you notice, the ball is drifting slightly to the right, but I, because I hit it good and I set up right, it stayed on the fairway, it got to the trees. Now we have an open shot to the green for our second shot, our approach shot, with a pitch, all right? This is really like real golf, if those that have played golf. Okay, so he's in a big rush and he's got a over here he's got a ball that's a power ball okay so you have to buy those or they do give them to you and uh, but I don't recommend you use them uh, except for maybe tournaments and see he's this guy's in a big rush to land in the rough you know he hits perfect shot it'd be great but when the needles going that fast and he did a good shot. job he's gonna bounce it it's gonna bounce and go to the right which <coughs> I don't think I've tried it so he's in the bunker <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me, getting over bronchitis. All right, fun stuff. All right, so this is pointed it right at the pin. Okay, so I'm just going to go up here and I'm going to put all the backspin I can. And then I'm going to take the shot. I'm not going to make a movement at all. The wind is 1.2 miles per hour going crossways. So what I'm going to do is just go sideways with my ball. Not add any more power, and I'm going to try and hit a perfect shot. Perfect and what shot. it'll do is it'll bounce to the right, and I just missed of going in. But that's okay. Nice He's shot. in the sand, and his needle is going to go very fast because when you hit the sand, that's the worst place you want to be unless you hit it a long ways on a golf hole, and the other person went a different direction. And if you're good at hitting this needle you'll notice it the more he pulls it back the faster it goes and so it's harder to hit perfect shot which is right in the center because there see he great missed shot. he missed and hit a great shot he's going to be ways way way 
from the green, but he can he'll be able to put that in. So we're going to be going into a shootout. We only play one golf hole in Golf Clash, and the winner is who got the lowest score on the on the card. Like if I'd have knocked that in, and he just missed, which he did, then I would have outright won. Ended up getting a birdie on a par four, and he will get a birdie because he'll be able to putt in. Then we'll go to a one-shot shootout. Whoever gets it in the hole or closer to the hole will be the winner. Okay, so. And sometimes these putts can be tricky, and I've seen people miss. See, he's on the left edge, and if he doesn't hit perfect, no, see, he's not going to hit the hole, I don't think. There he goes. So you have to be very careful putting. I'm just going to send him a, like, shocked face that he missed that, because that was very easy. So he lost a couple trophies. I end up winning 200 coins and a silver chest. Okay. And he doesn't want to play anymore, which is fine. You don't have to play the person you... Sometimes people are fun and they chat with you. Okay, so that's one game. Um, you know, it worked out well for me. Over here at the bottom right corner is my um, clan that I'm involved with. These are all the coins that we just had a tournament go through. See if I can find... I don't think I can find myself because I have no picture. But I'll go in there and look at the members, and it keeps track of who's in what place. And it shows what everybody did. Okay, I'm in 29th place in this clan. I've only put four clan points together. But I did play in the tournament. Okay, did not enter the... Oh, no, that's right, too. I never... I didn't get... I, I only opened this account a few days ago, so... So it shows the tournament results. Uh, Instinct got 80th place. Uh, Jesus loves you. Got 28. John 3:16. Got um, 33, and so on. And uh, my name is it's it's me Bob. Okay, that's just my handle. It's not my real name. All right. So I hope you enjoyed that. These are different people. You can chat with people. These are the members, and this is the league that we're in. We're in 69th place. Okay, and it's a lot of fun. You could chat with people and encourage people. And when I do play with people, I do say good shot and things like that. All right, so I thank you for watching. And I will end this video here. And uh, take care. Bye.